Oh, all my warrants. My warrants are getting cleaned up. Um, I've been paying off fees and getting rid of shit, talking to certain people to help my uh, situation out. Um, Cause you know, I have my son, so the old me would have just turned myself in and that would have threw in from inside to the outside of the jail. So whatever, so I don't be like, you know, but uh, right now I gotta play cautious because you know, I don't, I don't plan on, um, Being in jail while my son is growing, like I just don't plan on that at all. So um, I'm doing every way possible to get that figured out without even trying to serve time. And it's working out for me. So I'm gonna work on my little situations and stuff. That's all about it. What up, this rapid so Krishan Rock is on the run like Tay K. So she refuses to turn herself in. She's saying she doesn't want to turn herself in because she has a son. Now, I don't know if that excuse is gonna work for the average person, but that's the excuse she is using and she's trying to use her resources to make this happen. I guess she's saying she's paying off people and paying fees and maybe she's having her lawyers talk to the counties that want her to turn herself in and maybe they're trying to work something out because she's not being super specific about her process, but it sounds like she has some lawyers on the case trying to figure out if she can not turn herself in. She's saying if it wasn't for a baby, she would have been turned herself in, but she's saying because she has a baby that this is not going to work. She doesn't want to leave her baby out here in the streets with whoever while she's doing time because Blueface is already locked up and she just doesn't think that's smart. And I kind of understand what she's talking about, but I don't think that's going to stop the average person from having to turn themselves in. So I don't get why, you know, that would be any different for her unless she can really just get by, maybe by paying some fees and stuff. So, look, it looks like this situation stems from an incident with uh, Woe Vicky and... There was another incident with Tamar Braxton, and I explained that in my last video. Go back and check that out. But this new warrant that has been popping up is something completely different. This is an unrelated warrant that's going on in Oklahoma. So I don't know exactly what county wants her to uh, serve some time now because it's all starting to blur. It's all starting to just kind of not make any sense because she has so many warrants out, it sounds like now with all these different situations. So I know for sure they were saying she had to turn herself in for the Woe Vicky and the Tamar Braxton incident, like I explained, but this Oklahoma incident is different. They're saying it has something to do with having substances and it sounds like a driving, uh, like they're calling it traffic. So I'm thinking it has to do with something while she was driving or something possibly, but traffic could mean a few different things. So. But they're saying it has something to do with substances when she was in Oklahoma and there's a warrant out that she's trying to take care of. So we'll have to see if this works out for her. But from what it sounds like is basically she's on the run. Maybe she's just trying to make excuses because the same thing happened with 42 Doug. He was supposed to turn himself in. He didn't think it was serious. So he decided to not turn himself in. And then they caught him coming off a plane one day. And they uh, sent him to jail. He had to sit down, I think, for an extra six months. So originally he had to sit, sit down for six months. I think he ended up doing almost a year. So they added some time for him refusing to turn himself in. So I'm thinking there's a chance that uh, Krishan Rock just might not be turning herself in. Like, even though she's saying she's working on it and trying to figure this out. I mean, once you have a date to turn yourself in and you don't I don't think that's how it works you don't just say um well nah I'm just not gonna that means that you are on the run in my opinion but she like I said she's claiming she has people handling it paying fees doing all this other extra stuff trying to get her out of this but you know who knows maybe she's just simply on the run and you know they might end up catching up with her I mean if she's wanted in Oklahoma Maybe just avoid Oklahoma or something. I don't know. I mean, because you can't necessarily come on another state to take you in and send you to Oklahoma. So, 
I don't know. That warrant might be like something where if she avoids Oklahoma, maybe that warrant won't reach out to the other states. I don't know how exactly how that works, but for now she's out and she's just refusing to turn herself in. That's just what she's doing. So I'll keep y'all updated as more information becomes available. Make sure you like and subscribe and click that notification bell. Sign up to Rap Hits Newsletters. All links are in the comment section. I also got some giveaways in there. So yeah, that's about it. I'm out of here.